don't forget, you can now get your baby Keisha plush toy at hellojuniper.com slash play. Well, look, lady, all right? Keisha's my sister, and I haven't heard from her for a week. I have a right to be worried about her and concerned. I'm not going home until I see her. Hey, girls and guys, it is Sunday from Sai Let's Play, and I am not back with my annoying little sister, Keisha, because... As you guys know, she has now officially gone to live with her mom. And I know I should be happy for her, but like I told you guys last time, I think, I don't know, there's something about Keisha's mom that I just don't trust. I'm not saying that she's not Keisha's mom. There's just something fishy about her. And I just, I don't know. I feel like there's more to the story that she's letting on. I don't think she's as sweet, as innocent as she's pretending to be. And... I don't know if Keisha's like not allowed to call me or not allowed to text me, but she's been gone a whole entire week and I have not heard from her once. Not even a text message saying hi, nothing. It's not like I live on the other side of the world. I literally live like two blocks away and she hasn't messaged or called back nothing. She didn't even post on her channel. She hasn't posted on Instagram. Like I'm starting to kind of freak out. Like, is she okay? Is her mom not allowing her like to talk to anyone? Like what's going on? I'm kind of getting worried. I have been calling her nonstop, but then I was kind of like, I don't want to seem like I'm being overbearing by calling her every five seconds. So I was like, okay, I'll give her some space and see if she calls me back. Still nothing at all. So I know this sounds crazy, but I kind of feel like I should go over there and just do a little spying. You know, maybe rent out the house in front of the mansion and have a little peek and see what's going on. At the end of the day, I know Keisha's not my real sister at all or whatever, but she's always going to be my sister in my heart. So I got to make sure she's safe. Like, I don't know what Kate's up to. And then she had that creepy cellar in her house, like that little safe place. And I don't trust that either. So I think I'm going to go around there. Is it still nighttime? Maybe I'll go around there and see what's going on. Just have a little peek. They should be home. It's late at night. I mean, there's no reason for them not to be there. So let's go ahead and quickly get over there and see what's going on. Because I want to get to the bottom of it. Why hasn't she responded to me? I mean, I know she's back with her new family and stuff, but she still should like text me back I took I've taken care of her forever and now she's gonna just like pretend I don't exist okay so I'm here but now I gotta be really careful luckily they have tons of rocks around so I feel like I could get a good view of everything all right so here we could see the kitchen and the living room there's no one there I mean they should be home it's super late at night there's there's no way they would be out around town by now Literally, there's no one home. There's no one there. But it makes no sense. I mean, they could have gone to go watch a movie or something, but there's no one at the restaurant. There's no one anywhere. Maybe I'll come back in the morning and see if she's there. I will say, though, to be totally honest, I do miss her. I've gotten so lonely, like the house is so quiet and stuff. And I know she used to always annoy me and drive me crazy, but now I really miss her. And I kind of been thinking about adopting another sister. I mean, there's a lot of children out in the world that need to be adopted. And I was thinking maybe I could replace her with someone else. But then I kind of felt bad because I don't want her to feel replaced and stuff. So I don't know. Maybe I was just thinking crazy. But all right, so I'm going to wait till morning time and then I'll walk over there. And if she's not there and if she doesn't answer my text messages, I'm going to knock on that door and I'm going to demand to see her because I deserve it. So I waited until the next day, the next night. And still, no answer for my phone calls, my texts, my emails, nothing. So I'm going to try again. I did come around earlier in the morning and no one was home. So let's check out this house again and see if she's there. There's no way they cannot be home for like 48 hours straight. Is she home right now? She better be home. I mean, like, it's late again. Oh, uh, is anyone there? <gasps> there she is. She's right there. She's watching TV or something. Hello? Knock, knock. Okay, she heard my knock. Is she trying to run and pretend she totally didn't hear that? Hello? She literally just looked at me. Does she like, is she just gonna, is she literally pretending I'm invisible right now? Oh my gosh, hello? 
She's going la 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 la. Really? Kate, I can see you. <laughs> what? She's just going to start cooking herself a meal now. Where is she going? Oh, no, 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 no. She is not running away. Where is she? Where, where did she go? Did she come in the living room? Where is she? That little snake. Where, there she is. Hello. There you are. Okay, she she cannot pretend she didn't see me just now. I'm, I'm saying she's like looking me in my face right now. Um, yes. Is she just going to talk to me through a window? Can I come in? Uh, what are you doing here? I'm here to see Keisha. Can we talk like normal people face to face and not through a window? Like, what is wrong with this woman right now? Why is she acting like this? My gosh, I do not have time for this. I'm tired. I haven't been sleeping well because I've been worried. It's nighttime. You'll have to come back another time. <laughs> I am not coming back here again. No disrespect, but I was here yesterday. I've been texting. I've been calling. I am done waiting around, coming back tomorrow, la 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 la, not doing none of that. No. I'm over it. Oh my gosh. Keisha told me you were very demanding. And no means no. <laughs> I am going to snatch this woman's weave. I know I should. Violence is not the answer. But she is really pushing my buttons right now. <gasps> okay. Mm. Can we talk face to face or I'm going to break in? Plain and simple, woman. I am tired of this. I don't have time for this. Like, it's late. I should be getting my beauty sleep. And instead, I'm dealing with this. <sighs> why is... Like, mm, mm. I know why she's acting like this. Because I already knew there was... I already knew there was something up with her. Something I couldn't trust. Hello? Is she just not going to talk to me now? Is she just ignoring me now? You can't just come around here whenever you want. Keisha has a structure at this home now. <laughs> oh, she unlocked the door. Should I just go in there? Oh, no. Okay, okay. Whoa, okay. Um. Uh, <laughs> well, look, lady, all right? Keisha's my sister, and I haven't heard from her for a week. I have a right to be worried about her and concerned. I'm not going home until I see her. Because how do I know she's not keeping her in that safe right there? I don't know that. She could be like holding her hostage or something. So, let me see her or I don't leave your property. What do you want? Hmm? What do you want to do? Because I have all day. I don't actually have all day because I'm tired. But I will be here all day every single day until I see her. What are you going to say to that, Kate? He just isn't here anyway. Um, well, where is she? It's late. She should be home. It's like... Super dark out. She tries to claim Keisha has a structure, but you let her out this late at night? Hmm. Yeah, sure. She just wants a mom of the year award. Do you not understand how this works? Maybe it's because I'm tired and I'm cranky, but I'm going to get real sassy with you, Kate. I don't like you. You don't like me. So let's cut to the chase. Let me see her or I'll call the cops. Okay, why is she getting all up in my face like that? You no longer care for Keisha, so you have no say in her life anymore. Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm gonna keep my hands to myself because I learned that in preschool. They used to tell you not to, to, to keep your hands to yourself. You got nothing nice to say. Don't say nothing at all, you know. So I'm just gonna try my best. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm her mother and you're just a pretend sister. I am not going to do this with you, Kate. I'm not going to go back and forth with you. Where is she? That's all I need to know. Seriously, I'm her pretend sister. Yeah, pretend. Yeah, like, who fed her? Who took care of her? Who took her to school every day? I did. So even if I was just a pretend sister, at least I was there for her. So yes, as a matter of fact, Kate, at least I was there for her and didn't leave her on the streets like you did. Ooh, trying to act like mother of the year. But she just left her out in the cold and stuff. I'm just saying, facts are facts, Kate. And if you want to talk about facts and call me a pretend sister, let's talk about the fact that you abandoned her. <laughs> She's at the beach party and Keisha will tell you the same. She's a free spirit now. That's how I treat my kids. Well, that's all I needed to know. <laughs> you let your kids go to the club. It sure says a lot about what kind of parent you are, Kate. Hmm. Unlike you, Miss One Million Rules. No Instagram, no internet. 
You're just controlling. <laughs> I'm sorry that I care about my little sister and the fact that the internet could be a scary place and I wanted her to be safe. He should have told me everything. <gasps> I'm not doing this with this woman. I'm done. Anyways, now that I know where she is, I don't need to talk to you. So bye, Felicia. <laughs> so now I just got to go find that child. Oh my gosh. I don't even know what kind of life Keisha's living now. Is she twerking at the club? Of course she is. Because she's Keisha. What else will we expect? Keisha! Keisha? 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 Hello? Don't start acting like you're a mom and pretend that you can't hear me. Keisha? Hello? Is, what is Kate doing to your ears? Like, is she like popping eardrums out there or something? Like, why can't you guys just not like not talk to me now? Oh, hey. So, do you not, do you not have a cell phone anymore? Do you not have an email? A YouTube channel? An Instagram account anymore? What are you doing here? I came to check on you. So can you answer my question? Do you not, do you not, do you not have a phone anymore? No internet? Nothing? I didn't ask how you're doing. I asked if you had a phone. Because apparently, you can't be bothered to answer my calls or my text messages when I'm worried sick about you and stuff. Wait. Keisha? Keisha, is that a tattoo on your shoulder? Keisha, if that is a tattoo, I will literally scrub that thing off of your skin. What is... Is that... You, you have one on your back. Oh, my... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me right now? Are you kidding me? My mom's so cool. You think it's cool for her mom to let a little kid get a tattoo? Look, when you're older and you want to make that decision yourself, go for it. But right now, you are like. <laughs> she lets me go to parties and get tattoos. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna call animal control to, to take you away. Okay, because, like, Keisha, that tattoo isn't real. Just please tell me that tattoo isn't real. Just, that's all I need to hear. It's just please tell me that tattoo isn't real. I'm not an animal. Well, you're acting like one. Please tell me it isn't real. Keisha, Keisha, please. Please just tell me. Oh, first of all, it's real. It's not real. It's not, it can't be real. It can't be real. They, <gasps> It is so obvious Kate is trying to buy Keisha's love right now. You vlogged it. You vlogged it? <laughs> you didn't even upload on your channel. Everyone was expecting you to upload a video. Even I was because that's the only way I could get updates on your life now since you don't want to call me or anything anymore. <gasps> oh my gosh. I want to. I don't even know what I want to do right now. I'm so. I am so angry right now. Because my mom is telling me she has to. Has to own it now. Your mom has to own what? Your YouTube channel? Well, that's your YouTube channel. It's not hers. Keisha, what got in your head to think you should get a tattoo? Do you see any other little kids at daycare with tattoos? No. And if anything, you usually get the little water ones that are like princesses. Not that. Oh my God. Keisha, that tattoo is huge. Oh, yeah, but I'm different. Yeah, you di you are different. You are very different. That that is that is for sure. I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm going to Keisha, you can't stay with your mom anymore. It's it's simple. You can't stay with her anymore. I'm not allowing it. No, you can't. My mom's going to do a video on my channel. Why? Why is your mom so interested in your YouTube channel? I think your mom's a clout chaser. That's what I think she is. Your mama is a clout chaser. Mm, she supports my YouTube. Yeah, I'm sure she does. Just like she probably... Mm -hmm. She's going to start her own channel too. Oh, you are kidding me. You are kidding me. Keisha, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Get in your stroller, okay? Get in the stroller and I'm taking you home. You're not. You're not. Mm -mm. She's such a cool mom. No, she's not. It's not cool to let your kid get tattoos, go to the club, and go to parties. You're getting in the stroller, and I'm taking you home. You're not staying with her. No, I'm not stopping, Keisha. Stay in there. I'm going to strap you in there. I don't care. You're not going back to that woman. I'm home. No, your home is not here. No. Not, not Keisha. Hmm. <sighs>
She is literally running back into her house. Wow. Look, I don't know how I'm going to do this. But I am getting Keisha back. There is no way I'm allowing that woman to take care of Keisha anymore. I don't care if that's her real mom or, or whatever, okay? Look, she hadn't she hasn't been around for years and all of a sudden she wants to come back into Keisha's life, let her get tattoos, go to parties, and do all these kind of dumb things. No. She's gonna have Keisha throw her away her life. I wanted I wanted Keisha to grow up and be a strong, independent woman who was like, I don't know, gonna become the president and stuff. And you know, she was gonna go with achieve great things in life but she's not gonna achieve those things if she's going out partying when she's not even like 10 years old yet i'm i can't even handle this i don't know what i'm gonna do but i'm getting keisha back for sure there is no way and i'm gonna keep an eye on her channel because why is her mom all of a sudden like oh i want to be in your youtube videos i want to be make my own channel She's a clout chaser. I'm telling you, mark my words. Anyway, you guys, I'm real upset right now. So I'm going to go ahead and end it here. I hope you guys had fun watching. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and share. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.